Hey y'all, this is Theron. I'm sorry, I got my puppies. My grand dogma. Who in here? Who in here? Um, I got one feisty one. Oh, let me show you her. Abigail. <sighs> this is Abigail, y'all. Ain't she cool? Say hey. Yeah. She just a feisty as she want to be. Ugh. Got to calm her down. But. This is Theron from your <laughs> from Dare to Dream 2013.com. And I'm here to help you dream. What did you say on January 1? On December 31st, 2012. Did you make some resolutions? Did you make some goals? Did you say you want to accomplish some things? Was it to lose weight and feel great? Was it to start a business? Was it to find the things that you like to do? Was it to help make more money? Ain't she so precious? Was it to help make more money in your business? Okay? For, and 47 days ago, what did you say? Are you still doing the same thing you did in 2012, but you're expecting the same results in 2013? You're insane. That's the definition of insanity. I'm asking you a question. Did you say that 2012, 2013, excuse me, is going to be better than 2012? Huh? Did you say that? Huh? Did you say that? Well, guess what? If you said 2000 and 13 is going to be better than your 2012 and you ain't doing nothing, then you are a liar. Yep, I said you're a liar. You're lying to yourself. If you said that 2013 would be better than 2012 and you ain't done nothing, if you ain't done no thing towards your goal, okay? Like for me, I said I want to lose weight. It's one of my um goals. And... I know if I don't track it, then I, I'm not gonna know what I've done to um, my progress. So I decided to put little stickies on my calendar. The green means I've exercised over 30 minutes. The red, Abigail. The red means the red means that I've exercised over 60 minutes. Okay. Over 60 minutes. It's January. She goes February. We're right here. I took a break. Had a had a visitor. <laughs> but you have to track and you have to decide what you want to do. Okay? I hate to call you out. I hate to call you a liar. But if you said that 2013 will be better than 2012, and in 47 days you have done no thing towards your goal, then you're just lying to yourself. And 2013 is going to be just like 2012. It's going to be just like 2011, and it's going to be 2000, just like it'll be two, in 2010. Until you do something, until you get that mindset of. Uh, you know, I'm gone. I'm sick and tired of living like this. I'm sick and tired of living from not only paycheck to paycheck, but income tax to income tax. Because it's tax time right now. Folks living good, okay? But I want you to dream. Dreams give us focus. Dreams give you direction. Have you met anybody that dreamed Have you met anybody that was successful and they and they did not know they were, where they were going? No. You have not met a successful person and they did not know what direction they were going in. One thing dreams do for you is they give you direction of where you're going. When you dream and you have a vision for your life, then you know where you need to go. You know what you need to do. You got direction. Just like I have a business to be that, you know, 
Yeah, bam. Back, you know, before children, B.C., before children body. But I know that um, sitting at home, doing nothing, doing the same thing I did in 2012 is not going to get me the results that I want in 2013. I got to be fine. I mean, I'm already fine. I got to be finer, you know? I'm aging just like fine. And I got to do what I have to do. And I have to hold myself accountable. And that's one reason why I believe that if you said that you wanted 2012, 2013 to be better than 2012, and you haven't done anything, it's because you don't have accountability. You don't have no one to tell because your circle of influence, obviously they ain't doing none either. So you don't want to tell them because they might put your dreams down. They may put what you want to do down and not hold you accountable and not push you to where you need to go. Then that help you, guide you, steer you in the right direction of where you need to go in 2013 so you can have the better life for you and your family and your children's children, okay? Visit my website, dare to dream 2013com Fill out your name, your email address, and your phone number so that I can call you and we can do a free pre-screening and we can talk about the things that you want to accomplish in 2013 and get some accountable when 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 you not when you don't have no accountability then you you're more likely to fall off and i like to use weight loss only because that's what i'm working on and i've done that before when I was in a weight loss class and had accountability, when I was tra tracking what I ate, tracking my exercise, and had to be accountable to going to the classes, I was dropping that weight. I was dropping like a oh, I was dropping that weight. But as soon as the class fell off, I was not, I, I had no one to keep a, me accountable. I started eating and not exercising as much, and I put back on some of that weight. So for me, I know accountability is what kept me or keeps me sometimes from not um, getting to where I need to be. But if you have somebody accountable that, and you're going to think, oh, shoot, I told her that I was going to do this. You're more amped to work on your goals. And if this is you and if you can relate to this video, if you can relate that, yeah, you know, something in me wants to do more, but my circle of influence, they ain't doing nothing. I just don't know what I need to do. I don't know. I don't know the first step, but I know something better. Visit my website, dare to dream 2013.com. Fill out your information and let's chat and we can help you move on to where you need to be in the next six months. This is Theron signing out. Until the next video, until we talk on the phone.